हेलो गाइस हाउ आर यू आई होप यू आर डूइंग ग्रेट इन योर लाइफ माय सेल्फ विक्रांत एंड वेलकम बैक टू डेव टाउन सो इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैड सीन डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ सिलेक्टर डेट आर आईडी एंड क्लास सिलेक्टर सो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सी व्हाट आर टारगेट सिलेक्टर्स सो लेट अस डायरेक्टली जंप ऑन टू आवर सेकंड स्लाइड दैट वी हैव सो आई एम जस्ट गोइंग टू गिव यू द बेसिक डेफिनेशन ऑफ टारगेट सिलेक्टर्स एंड आफ्टर दैट वी आर गोइंग टू सी दिस सिलेक्टर्स विद द हेल्प ऑफ सम एग्जांपल्स so that you can get a proper idea of how to use this particular selector okay so target selectors are basically an urls with an hashtag followed by an anchor name link to a certain elements okay so let's say if we are naming our elements for like a hashtag followed by the name of that particular element which we want to target then in this case the target selector will comes into place but how to use that particular target selector so we for that we need to write colon and target and after that we need to uh, like give the properties and value inside curly brackets so how to implement this let us see with the help of vs code and our chrome browser so here i have opened my index.html page and i am just passing on like i am just importing our boilerplate code for index.html for the basic html boilerplate code and i am just gonna title it as target okay target selector it should be target selector and after that what i am going to do i am going to take one div tag okay and inside this div i am just going to take let's say one anchor tag and on anchor tag i am passing on ref okay but before taking anchor tag i want to have some div let's say this is the first div i want some another div let's say that's the second div okay so no issues but the thing that i want is id so i can give it id of 1 for first div and for second div we will pass on a id of 2 let's say h1 tag in both side just to represent one is click or second is click and 2 okay and i am giving a ha see in the definition itself i i, I said that we need to um, like write hashtag followed by the tag which we are targeting so we are targeting hashtag and which hashtag one okay so one is rep uh, one is basically representing this particular div and for second div we are writing two okay and the content should be one and two okay so that's the basic structure let us just open this with the help of live server so yeah it's working fine right now it's working fine okay so the next thing i want is the target selector so in the style section uh, i am going to use the target selector so if we are using directly target selector without using anything okay so let us see whether it works without passing on any other any other let's say any other tag or something like that so it should be solid red i am normally saving it normally it's whenever i am clicking on this one i want my this divs to have a border of solid red so whenever i am clicking on one so you are able to see that i am getting a border of this red and whenever i am selecting two i am getting a border of two okay so that's the thing okay so in this way we can like style our we can we can style our different elements with the help of target selectors so this so uh, like you might be asked ki where is like what is the application of this target selectors then you can say for making that slide bar you can say for making side bar as well and for making the uh, the growth chart you can say okay so basically in progress chart also you, we can use this target selectors so that is the basic basic application i can say about target selectors and one more thing which i wanted to show you is let's say if i want my class to uh, see, uh first of all let me do one thing so let me just give my outer div a class name of tab let's say and i am selecting that particular tab by using class selector dot tab and inside that tab what i want my divs my div and to 
my div to have a display of let's say none i am select i am just saving this so right now my my content is gone okay so it is hidden basically right now okay and whenever i am selecting this dot tab okay and inside that i i want to have a target i want to select the target element so in this way i can select them i am just simply saving it nothing nothing else and i am just giving it a display of a block yeah because i want my elements to show up whenever i am clicking on anything so right now two is coming because here we are referring it to the html like two two side see right now nothing is present over there and whenever i am going to click on that particular thing let's say i am clicking on one then only my element will be shown see right now one is showing after that two will show you one two one two okay so in this particular way also we can like make a use case of this particular selector so yeah i hope you guys have got the idea of what target selector is and how to use them basically so that's all about target selector i hope you guys have got the idea and if you are liking the content and if you are new to the channel first of all then do share do share this content and subscribe the channel as well and i will see you in next video guys until then goodbye